might be young at heart but we're still dreaming eyes wide open leave this place behind no matter what they say yeah because we're stronger than Hey, awesome humans, how is it going this evening? And it's this evening here in Golden, BC, Canada, in the heart of the Rocky Mountains. Hey, listen, I've had this YouTube channel. I've been seriously doing some editing for about a year now, and I just want to say thank you to all the people who have subscribed and continue to stick with me on this channel. I'm bringing you some adventures from the heart of the Canadian Rocky Mountains. I'm 57 years old and I don't think I'm dead yet. So I hope everybody that's joined me has uh, been enjoying the content I've been putting out. And thank you for joining my channel. And um, I'm going to show you a little bit of what it's like, life in the Rocky Mountains, my style. And yeah, everybody, there's been a lot of new guys and uh, girls joining my channel. And even this evening, I saw I got a couple of new subscribers. So I just want to say thanks, guys. And I really appreciate it. Hang in there. Hopefully, I'll show you some cool stuff in Canada. And we're going for a ride for uh, to Lake Louise today on my motorcycle. So yeah, join me for this little rip, guys. And thanks for subscribing. Cheers. Beautiful day. A little nippy. Boy, the sun feels nice. Windy today. Might try fly later. Getting all the feta cheese. I think we'll go to Lake Louise. Check that out. Another 20 minutes. But, uh, yeah, guys, check out this view. Where I'm sitting having my lunch. Lake behind me. Geese over here. Crazy mountains. Friggin' awesome. Love where I live. Anyways, guys, I'm gonna finish my lunch and uh, yeah, I'll we'll catch you on the road. Out in stormy weather, I might have the blues, but nothing ever stopped me from dusting off my shoes. You might think you'll see me falling to the ground.
And I'm having a little mini cigar thing, which is really friggin' tasty, and I love it. I was smoking cigars after holidays a couple years ago. I uh, threw the cigars away. And I started to nicotine gum, which I really love the flavor of. And uh, I quit the nicotine gum and I bought a small mini vape and that wasn't very good. Then I bought a bigger vape and I've been vaping. Just, I don't smoke pot anymore so just vaping uh, like nicotine, like a cigarette. So the other day I threw the vape away <laughs> and now I'm on this ride and I'm friggin' jonesing for something. So uh, anyways, <laughs> I have this can of, I'll show it to you after when I stop, when I drink it and have the rest of my lunch. Anyways, I was jonesing for a fucking a cigar and uh, so I stopped and got these little guys bad idea bad idea what do you think look at those mountains back there guys I know you can't see them very good but uh, Lake Louise is straight back behind me kind of in that uh, you probably can't see it but it's like right back there I'll go check it out for you I gotta find somewhere to take a whiz. I should put the charger on you guys. You look like you're friggin' dying again. I think I'll do that actually. So, uh, we'll see you guys. I think I'll, uh, yeah, I'll turn you guys on for the ride up to the lake. Huh. 
All right, guys, let's take a little ride up to the lake. It's not even busy here yet. Anyway, we'll go for a quick walk. Yeah. You guys are gonna die, so I think I'll probably just turn you off for a second. Anyway, guys, I'm charging you as we go, hopefully. Uh, famous Lake Louise. Some cool huts way back up in the top. Some tea houses you can hike to. There's some high altitude climbing huts. People are risking their lives on the lake. I'm sure it's safe still, but getting a little late in the year. Chateau de Clubies. Let's go in and have a look. Thank you. Famous Canadian maple syrup. Um, I should buy a container and drink it. <laughs> I haven't been in here in a while, so I'm somewhat lost. They have changed it quite a bit. From what I remember. Yeah, they changed it a lot. Out here by these main bay windows, you used to be able to sit. Uh, we were young, my buddy Jim and I came in here and be all stoned. Smoke a fat pound of weed, and they had these really cool chairs out here. Great big king and queen chairs that overlook the lake. We could sit there and uh, bring our crib board in, play a little bit of crib, overlook on the lake. Now it looks like you're not allowed to do that anymore. 
But for now, I'm going to get the hell out of here. I'm going to go back to field. And hopefully there's some sun over there still. See the beehive up there? See the beehive up there? There's a tea house right up on top of that sucker. You can go up there and pay $17.50 for a half a sandwich. <laughs> but it's worth it, though. But you got to pay attention. The chipmunks will steal it on you. They're really good at it. Same with the whiskey jacks. Yeah, they have it under control. So, and if I'm not mistaken, there's another tea house on top of that, and that one's called the Bee House. Yeah. Uh, I know you guys can't see, but I'm going to take you up here one day. If you go up that gully, all the way up, you can enter the mountain in the mines and come out somewhere there in that snow. And then you go back along the cliff band to get back down. Really cool in there. The mines in there are a little sketchy. They're all lots of cave-ins. Castle Mountain. That's pretty, hey? Wow. What is this? Vodka soda. Peach. 5%. 5% is not going to kill anybody. Let's see if I even like it. If I don't, I got water. I also have a processed food snack. Yay. I'm not going to eat all of it, but <laughs> that does look good though. Picklies. Oh, I love sweet pickles. Vodka soda. Oh, yeah, that's okay. Okay. Well, as you can see, guys, the sky is turning shitty. Er, that's not horrible, but I'll close here. I think I'm gonna hit the road. I'm gonna go for a little walk. I think, but the camera's just about dead. Even with my charge pack, it's fairly cold out. My, I have my riding jacket on, a sweater like a fleece and a shirt, t-shirt and uh, it's just enough sweatpants on under my riding pants so it's, I'm pretty warm that way but it's 4 o'clock the way the wind is blowing I doubt that it'll be flyable tonight I'm hoping but I doubt it anyway in, in the meantime and in between time Cheers. Hope you guys enjoyed the ride along. And we'll see you in the next one. Or a beast. Or a beast. No doubt about it.